guys, what's up? Today we're going to be learning the pentatonic scales, major and minor. They're pretty much the same thing. Uh, if you didn't know, this is actually a makeup lesson for two weeks ago. Sorry, I had a lot of homework and I missed a week, so this is a makeup for that week. We're going to be learning scales. They're really useful for, for solos and playing over chords, which I'll probably teach in another lesson later. So to start, let's just dive right in and figure them out. Okay, so to start off, um, I'm just going to be playing the A major and minor, and I'm going to start with the minor. So the minor, they're in the pentatonic scale, there's five patterns. Pattern one. So pattern one, you start on the root note, so A, so find your root note on the E string, so A would be the fifth fret of the E string. And then you go three steps up, so... three frets up, sorry, one and a half steps. And then your root note, you're gonna stay on the fifth fret all the way down. So you're just gonna go five, eight, and then move to the A, five, seven, five, seven, five, seven, five, eight, five, eight. So that's five, eight, five, seven, five, seven, five, seven, five, eight, and five, eight. So that's pattern one. And then the next pattern, you're going to slide up. So you're going to be on the fifth fret of the E, which is going to be an A. You're going to slide up here to the seventh fret of the E. So you're, then you're gonna go seven, nine, six, nine, six, nine, six, eight, and then seven, nine, seven, nine. So seven, nine, six, nine, six, nine, six, eight, seven, nine, and seven, nine. And then for the, that was the second shape. So then the third shape. You're gonna, so the first one, it's on the 5th fret, 2nd shape, 7th fret, 3rd shape is actually on the 10th fret, so you go 10, 12, 10, 12, 10, 12, 9, 12, 10, 13, and then 10, 12. So 10, 12, 10, 12, 10, 12, 9, 12, 10, 13, 10, 12. That's pattern three. Then pattern four, you go up to the 12th fret and you go 12, 15, 12, 15, 12, 14, 12, 14, 13, 15, 12, 15. So 12, 15, 12, 15, 12, 14, 12, 14, 13, 15, 12, 15. That's pattern four. And then for pattern five, you slide all the way down here, start on the third fret, so it's three, five, three, five, two, five, two, five, three, five, three, five. Three, five, three, five, two, five, two, five, three, five, three, five. That's pattern five. So pattern one starts on the fifth fret. Pattern two starts on the seventh. Pattern three starts on the tenth. Pattern 4 starts on the 12th, and Pattern 5 starts on the 3rd. And that's the minor. So you're going to start on the root note of Pattern 1, and then you're just going to keep going through, and that's going to be um, that's going to be the minor pentatonic scale. For the major, it's the same thing. You start on the root note, but instead of starting on Pattern 1, you just start on Pattern 2. So it would be... So you start on pattern two, and then just go all the way through until you're done. Okay guys, that's all I have t for today's video. Um, so I went through the minor and major pentatonic scales. Remember for the minor, you start on pattern one on the root note, and go all the way through to pattern five. And for the major, you start on pattern two, and go all the way through back to one. Um, yeah, they're really useful, the scales, they're really useful for solos and playing over chords, which I said I'll probably do in another video soon
My next video will probably be on another song, not theory, and I'll see you then.